Okay, here we go. Looking for... God, this is the place. Okay. Don't worry. Oh, yeah. Okay, this is exactly where I want to be. Fantastic. Now we just gotta fight that big dude. Um, and that's it. Okay. Let's do it. This isn't the way to him, right? No, this is the way back to the ship. Whoo! Okay, that was a big circle we had to make. Let me practice my fighting skills against... <laughs> Never mind, he ain't looking, I'm getting out. Whoop! Okay, what's that? What's that do? Remind me, little guy. Yeah. Was there anything below us? It was last time, but... Hmm. It says there's something breakable over here? Is that what I'm seeing? No, it's definitely in the other, in the other chamber. It's definitely in this boss chamber. Where there's things happening and secrets going on. If we can plunging attack him, I think that'll make it about a billion times easier. There's a broken door we can get through, which will probably lead us up to that secret. Oh, he sees us. Okay, we've lost the element of surprise. Never mind. Patience. Don't get crazy. Don't get crazy. BD. He's got one, two, threes. No. Dang it. Man, he gets you once and you get stuck in that chain and you are done. Alright, well, we almost got him this time, so I think we got him. I think we can, uh... We can definitely do it. Sorry, I was just contemplating my loss and trying to rethink my life. Here we go. Nope. We're just gonna stay out of sight. Just turn around, my man. Nothing to see here, just a little droid riding on the waves. I was trying to check the hair model if it changes when you're wet. I think it just gets darker. But, you know, I could be wrong. It could have definitely given you a wet hair model. Let me out! Now we, we we good, BD. All right, here we go. Oh. 
Dang it, I missed it. Oh god, my body. Mmm, this ain't good. No, don't jump towards him, jump away! Oh god. Now I'll heal. Yeah. That was a bad one, guys. That was a bad one. This whole episode is just gonna be me getting bopped in the face by this thing. Hold on, I'm gonna go turn the light on. My goodness, it's getting dark. All right, we're back. I almost, uh, you know, trip, fall, whatever. It's fine. It's just a light. We connected, uh, the way my setup is for streaming and, uh, for recording things is a little bit interesting because, well, I don't have a monitor, so I have to use my TV, but I had to bring my microphone to my face, and, you know, my computer's over there, so there's a lot of things that had to be moved and, like, reconfigured in my place to bring you this entertainment. But, uh, you know, we do what we gotta do. I don't have a plan for this big dude. We almost got him pretty good the first time. Okay, here we go. Dang it. All right, we're good to go. Let's uh, let's go through here. Over here, BD. Cool. Let's go through here. Great. There we go. Sweet. Easy fit. Jump. Swing on him. Well, that's a big hit. Man, had I landed the first time, this guy would have been dead. Oh, it's the break of stamina. That's why I was having so many problems. Hey, BD. Because I can't slow him very well, if at all. But this, the minute your stamina breaks and you get caught in that three-swipe combo, you're dead. Okay. Okay. I wonder if I can counter this dude. I wonder if I can counter this guy. That would make life really easy. Because I feel like I'm getting the counters pretty solid on some other things. But if I can just be patient and wait for him to hit me with them swings and encounter when I get the right timing, if that'll kill him pretty quick, I think we'll be in a good spot. But if I can't get him really quick, <laughs> that's the problem. It's either you do it or you miss and you die. So there's no real in-between with this game. Sekiro is pretty forgiving. Dark Souls is pretty forgiving. I just gotta find the right spot here. And I think once I find it, I'll be good. But then isn't that kind of the phrase for every video game? Once you kind of find out what makes most video games tick, it's pretty easy going. But... You ever found that time on one of them where you're just like, yeah, I got it, and then the game becomes super boring? I don't want that to happen with this game. That would be a huge shame. Can I dive? I can't. Can I force pull it? Like, what really bummed me out 
is in Metal Gear Rising, there's like an easy way to parry. And once you figure that out, like, you're just a monster. Which, of course, like, it's built into the system, but... Like, that's always, that's always a bummer. Because I feel like, once again, this comes back to my argument where, as gamers, once you found out, and this comes to just, like, human nature also, once you found out the most efficient way of doing it, you're gonna do it. And unfortunately, in some games, the most efficient way, and we've, we've seen it in, like, the Destiny Loot Cave and stuff like that, is not the intended way, nor is it the most fun way. So... Oh, my body! Oh, God! I'm dead. Uh, but yeah, like, um... There was... What was it? Dead or Alive 5? No. Dead or Alive 4. Um, to beat, uh, like, the hardest difficulty, since that game, people, I'm sure the developers are going to be like, bro, it doesn't read your button inputs. Don't lie to me, Tecmo. I know the game reads your button inputs to counter properly and counter your throws and get all that jazz going. But like the end of the game, hitting a basic combo or just hitting a basic punch kick is pretty, pretty difficult just in general. Um, so is just general throws on the final boss. So what happens is, uh, if you use Ryu Hayabusa and you use his Flying Swallow ability, you're going to beat that game. So a lot of people who have uh, beaten it on the hardest difficulty of beating it as right Ryu Hayabusa, because it's the most efficient way of doing it, in the quickest way possible, without wanting to like pull your hair out while you're trying to beat the game with it reading your button inputs. So, like, there's... There's kind of the trick that you see a lot is, hey, I got it, but I got it because I, I figured out how to cheese it and I didn't want the game reading my button inputs anymore, so I decided to do something the game couldn't avoid properly. Um, there's kind of a lot of instances like that, like, um, what was I just playing? I was playing one of the arcade editions of, uh, like, the Sega collection, or the, or the SN... No, it was the Capcom side-scroller collection, and you could just, like... It would take you a long time in, um, Knights of the Round, but boy, if you just took your time and walked through pairing everything, like... You were golden. But did it make the game fun? I wouldn't say it did. I'd say it had the opposite effect and made me go, that's about enough of Knights of the Round today. So. Oh, okay. Well. Looks like I have won. Go me. Alright, so, yeah, whenever you parry him, it doesn't actually do a parry, it just... Oh, okay. It just maintains your, um, your stamina gauge. That works. Well, that doesn't. Holy jeez, sorry for screaming in the microphone, that scared the crap out of me. God! Okay. Now, what do we have here? We'll jump up. Or not. No, we gotta be able to jump up, right? What? Wait. Wait. It looks like we can hop up somewhere. On this side? Peculiar. What do you say, BD? What do you say on the minimap? You say this is a dead end? But why? Why would this be a dead end? That doesn't make a whole lot of sense. Hold on. Hmm. I guess... I guess so? Maybe there's something above us that I'm not getting. Stupid jerk plant scaring me. Okay, let's go up here. Uh, 
Um, nope. I want that. I feel like I earned it. But then you're in the world of Star Wars. Did I really earn it? I don't know. I got I got this parry thing going on. Huh. Okay. There's two doors. Can I force push them? Force pull them open? Stop them from being irritating? No? Okay, there's get yeah, there's definitely gotta be something in here. Unless you fall from a height and you end up in this big room. Which would be unfortunate. God. Not feeling so great, BD. Can I pull something? Hmm. Yeah, weird. Maybe we come back later. I don't know. I'm definitely stumped here, guys. Uh, can't force slam. There's nothing. Yeah, I'm gonna call it. Uh, wait. There we go. I was like, oh, nope. Good thing I didn't call it and walk off. I was like, I don't get it. However, they wanted me to look at the floor. Turn on the lights, BD. Is this the way through? This whole new area has got exciting vibes to it. What happens if I close that? Oh, okay, it closes the shutter. BD, need an overcharge here. Nope. Ooh. Am I getting exploration music right now? Is this what I'm talking about? Hold on. Can I... Can I jump out like that? Hmm. No, I definitely have to swing across. Up here. This is what I'm talking about, guys. Ugh. Nope! Oh, get parried, dog. You didn't know I had moves like that, did you? Oh, boy. Okay, okay. You right. Nope. Ugh. Stop choking me, oh god! Oh no! Okay, Chief. I'm getting tired of you. Um, hmm. Oh, wait. Hold on. BD, think you can charge this? It opens that door over there. Huh. I definitely have to be able to push something through, right? Maybe not. Huh. Oh, you know what? I think I see. Okay, maybe I don't see. If I slow it, what would that... What would that possibly do, though? Because I can just go like this. And that stops it. Thanks for the help. But it's definitely got to be moving for something. Because that opens that door. Can I pull myself across somehow? Yeah. 
Okay, I think I see it. Can I do something with this? There it goes. All right, Chief, hit it again. Thank goodness. General, are you injured? I'm fine, Commander. Wait, where is Marcel? Where is my Padawan? My men are scouting the wreckage now. We'll find them. I'm getting a transmission now. Probably the squad. Oh. Uh, hang on. It's from the Supreme Chancellor. Never mind. There we go. Oh, boy, I'm glad it didn't chop me in half. That would have been a downer. Wait, yep, okay. Let's get back to the ship finally. Boy, this has been a long run. Will that lead me down there? The way I want to be? That'll get me out. All right, here we go. Almost there. So close. So close. Sorry, there's a, there's a cat at my door. Hold on. Give me one second. Alright, we good to go. Okay, here we go. Sweet. Rest. Yep. We'll use the skill tree. Okay, we upgrade the force. The throw is still three points, and the power throw is five in total. What's the power throw do? Okay. Is that just a unit of measurement? Like, it goes two and a half stormtroopers long? Whirlwind throw. Now that's nifty. Alright, we'll just keep it going and we'll keep building our skill points. Oh, will that get us down there quicker? Yep, that'll get us down there quicker and then we'll come right back up. Sweet. Here we come, game. What? Oh, God. Come back from this. You'll have to try harder. Ow, my face. Yeah, I can, dog. You're not that good. What? What? That's a cool move. I'll give you that. Oh no 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 no! Oh my god! Did they just kill me? Reawaken. Okay. What was this? How do I reawaken? I'm smashing X as much as I can. Uh, square. Am I awakening somewhere else? Has the plot thickened? I've been captured. I don't understand. Did my game freeze? No, stuff's moving. There we go. 
I've been captured. Maybe. I've been sold out by the night witches, and then they're going to sell me into slavery and smuggle spices in me. Okay, I'm definitely captured. Guys, the tables have turned. Okay. BD. Bro. Where are we? Where's BD? BD1? Do I not have Hello, my lightsaber? Buddy. Where are you? No lightsaber. Okay. BD? Good thing I got my force I powers. Way out of here. Yeah, Whatever I mean. Here is. Okay, can't do anything with that. Alright. I like that. That's a good feeling. Is that a power cable? Not for long. Okay. Let's get this uh, plugged in somewhere, I suppose. Cool. Just, you know, being destructive in my cell. Where would this plug into, I wonder? All right, nothing suspicious to see here, folks. Just me and my power cable. I think it plugs in down here, but I can't be sure. It gives it to me. I can't force throw it anywhere. Hmm, you ever feel like this is your first day on like your hard job, you're like, okay guys, well I got this stuff, but I don't know where to put it, but I'm holding it, and they're just like, sir, what are, you, what are you doing? You're like, I'm, I'm supposed to be carrying this, right? Like, we all agree? Here we go. Something back there. Not that. Um, yeah, there we go. Blue. That did it. Yeah, now y'all in trouble. Stale. Might be deep underground. Okay. Well, I'm glad that thing can't attack me right now. Oh, that's right, I don't have BD. I was about to check my... BD? I can't check my hollow map without you, bro. Um, no. Hmm. I didn't do anything. What's this? Um, okay. Let's try this. No, these are... These definitely like zipline things. Let's unplug you. This looks like it works on this door. Let's unplug you. You don't seem to make a difference. It's a cruel statement, but it's true. Let's get you in here. Do I have to make some kind of circuit with these wires? Looks like this thing only plugs into here. Okay. Looks like this one. Only plugs into... I don't think it plugs... I don't think it gets... Yeah, it doesn't get that far. Alright, well, let's do it. It's got power now. Okay. That side has power. Does this door open? Nope. Alright, so we need to supply power to the other side. Do 
this can't go over there. This can't reach there. So let's keep this plugged in. And then we'll take this cable and plug it into this side. Huh. My logic is faulty. No worries. Doesn't look like I can interact here at all. So. Looks like there's power cables up there that I can pull. Okay. No, it looks like they're just powered cables. Interesting. I wonder if there's something back here I missed. Sleeping things, sleeping things. Bugs. Nothing I want to wake up. I can go in here, but that's about it. Alright then, here we go. Puzzles with wires. Let's get this unplugged. Okay, that doesn't come around. That does reach there. I did something. There it is. Now we're getting somewhere. Door opened up. I was just, I was backwards. Let's see if I can find a way out of here. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Go back, Cal. I didn't know we were finding a way out of here through here. I like these little animations of the up and under things that he's got going on with the head bob. It's pretty slick. Let's take this and plug it in. Or do I need BD? Yeah, that's going to be a BD thing. Alright, let's get out. Okay. Fantastic. Feels like I'm being watched. Whoop! What's that noise? Oh. I'm glad I just need to log to my death. Um. Wait a second, what? Never mind. I definitely thought I was somewhere aside from where I actually was. Unless I'm actually on a meteor. What happened to them? Yeah, not gonna be able to do anything there. Can I swing from it? <laughs> Never mind, you know, some of the ideas I get are just not conducive to anything. But it's like, I feel like I still have to try, you know? Let me uh, come up over here. Oh, BD, my boy. BD, BD, what? Is that you? I found you. Are you okay? Let's get you out of there. Okay. Well, that is a chart. Wait. There's definitely something down there. Okay. Great. Now 
Get me down. I don't know if that's how I was supposed to get down here, but that's... That's how I got down here. Also, I don't know if I was supposed to even get in here. Here comes the swing. Oh good, you can swing from it. Fantastic. So I wasn't... I wasn't wrong at all. Great. It feels nice when your ideas aren't actually dumb. Yeah, Beatty. Hey. Oh, I'm happy to see you too. Let's get that restraining bolt off of you. Jerks. Reunited. Now, where's my lightsaber? More droids. Let's get out of here before the same happens to us. Wait, let's see if we can upgrade you with something, maybe. Droid jail. That's unfortunate. Uh, wait, did you splice it, BD? Thanks, Chief! Alright. Now we got our map. Oh, I feel so good. The boys are back. Let's find a meditation spot, Let's and then I think we'll here. be solid. Alright, my man. Hit it. Just what we need. Alright, now I just need this side. There we go. Now what do we need? That's powered, that's powered. We'll just step on this. Hear that? Sounds like someone is home after all. Good. Hey, I recognize this band. It's the Who. It's the Who. Okay, let's let's get real hyped for a second and do it. Yeah, do it. Is this the arena arc? Ah, finally, he arrived. You dang straight. And who are you? I'm gonna look this up real fast. I'm Zork Tormo, baby. I'm the boss of this operation. You have breezy forearms to thank for bringing us together. I will, as soon as we get out of here. We have a special challenger for you tonight. An enforcer from a bygone era. <gasps> it is the Who! Sick! Let's see what he's got. Oh, somebody get baby his toy. <laughs> Joe? That's what I'm talking about. Yep, that gets me super hyped, man. That the Who is doing the song for. That's cool. It's one of those things where, like, there's a band you like, and it helps you. It helps sell it. Oh, is that so? Watch my moves, boy. Oh God, watch my moves out of here. Oh God, my body. That was not just wait. 
What? Oh god! Oh jeez! I died. Alright guys, I was getting a little bit too hype. Uh, let's go ahead, I'm gonna take a break for a second, and then... I was starting to get into like my Metal Gear Rising Bayonetta business because I was starting to get hyped so there were lots of buttons being pushed when buttons shouldn't be pushed. So I'm going to go ahead, take a little bit of break, get some food, and then we'll be back a little bit later. Uh, thanks for checking it out, man. This game is really hitting in good some, some good spots. Uh, yeah, I'm glad that May the 4th came up because I probably wouldn't have played this. It's a very solid thing going on. So I will catch you guys in a little bit. All right, have a good one, guys. Thanks for checking it out.